All right, spring will officially start less than 24 hours. It arrives with the March equinox. That's sure. 524 tomorrow night. Really going to be a nice start to the season yes. after, gosh, it, it's been a rough weekend. <laughs> You Meteor know? Meteorological spring began on March 1st. Okay. Tomorrow, astronomical. Okay. Who's, you know, bottom line is it doesn't feel like it, but this right. week we're finally going to start uh, yes. getting a little bit warmer here. We're ready. So, yeah, let's, we cashed in uh, our check, I think, uh, for, for, the, February? for that warm stretch run we yeah, had. Yeah. Uh, this morning, as cold as it's been since February, you have to go back to the 4th of February. We got down to 17 in Indy this morning. Daily record low, by the way. Not even close to it, but still plenty cold with some of that fresh snow that we had from those bursts overnight tonight and very early in the morning. And we could see the snowpack thanks to the uh, bright sky. We could see it on visible satellite. I mentioned earlier in the show that March snowpack doesn't last long. Voila, boom, gone uh, quickly here. Temperatures responding to the sunshine, but nowhere near where they should be for daytime highs. Uh, keep in mind our average lows typically in the low to mid 30s, but compared to 24 hours ago, over 15 degrees warmer, and that's a hint of what's on the way. We are going to get into the lower 50s tomorrow, and not after a chilly start, but we're going to peak in the low to mid 50s here across central Indiana, and it will look the part of spring once we get there. But notice the morning temperature well into the lower 20s. So you'll need the heavy coats. Kids will too. They'll shed it pretty quickly as we get into the afternoon. This is Tuesday. We'll be in the warm sector of this system. Showers arriving Tuesday evening and we'll have intervals of rain uh, as we go into Wednesday. Doesn't mean it will be raining nonstop. There'll be some dry hours. Uh, and we're still in the warm side of this system as we go into Wednesday and Thursday. And Thursday, by the way, will be the warmest day this week. We will approach 70 degrees. We'll still have some showers around. Looks like the wettest stretch run is going to come in Wednesday night, early Thursday, and then again Thursday night into Friday. Friday looks rather uh, soggy in my opinion. Some rumbles of thunder around. Early call for next weekend. Yeah, a little more like it. Not as cold. And right now it looks dry. Let's hope that holds.